What's up guys, this is Massey, welcome to my channel. This video I continue with giving you some examples regarding stoichiometry and relating the masses of two reactants to each other. This question is in the combustion of octane C8H18, how many grams of O2 are consumed per gram of octane? So we have octane plus O2 gives us CO2 and H2. The first step is to balance this chemical equation. So we balance it and we end up having 25 over 2. So in order to get rid of this fraction, we need to multiply everything by 2. So it's going to be 2, 25, 16, and 18. So for every 2 moles of octane, we need to have 25 moles of oxygen. And the question is saying that how many grams of oxygen we need per gram of octane. So the first thing I need to find the molar mass of octane which is 8 times 12.01 atomic mass of carbon 18 times 1.008 which is going to be 114.224 grams per mole so n will be m divided by m 1 divided by 114.224 which is going to be 0 0.0087 moles that's the number of moles of octane so we have 2 moles, 25 moles of oxygen. Now if we have 0 0.0087 moles, how many moles of oxygen? So we cross multiply it. Give me 0.10875 moles of oxygen needed. That's number of moles, we need to find mass, so mass will be m times m, n is 0.10875, and molar mass for O2 is 31.998, will be 3.48 grams. This the number. That's the mass of oxygen needed to react completely with one gram of octane. I hope you enjoyed this video. Please leave me a comment if you have any question and I get back to you as soon as possible. And please don't forget to subscribe to this channel. You can find out lots of videos regarding stoichiometry and other topics in chemistry and math. Thank you and have a great day.